I'm not gonna lie, like <laughs> sometimes I just wanna be a better man. <laughs> yeah. You say you wanna be a better man. You know it's hard out here for a man. I'm just saying <laughs> if I was Batman <laughs> or Iron Man, I might be able to do this man. <laughs> Come on, man. What the fuck, man? Shout out to Cam. What the fuck, man? <laughs> nah, because what the fuck, man? <laughs> oh, God. You know it's hard out here. <laughs> Between Cam and Terrence Howard, man. I don't know what the fuck we going to do this week as a black coach. Because I think nah, with Terrence, Terrence Howard. <laughs> Nah, nah, we need that nigga. Yeah, Between facts. Terrence, we need that facts. nigga. Cam Rod. I think if it we is put money oh. symmetrical. <laughs> Wait, what you was about to If we put money, it's some more money in Terrence Howard pocket, you can turn to Elon Musk. We need that nigga. <laughs> you can turn into Iron Man. Yeah, I'm trying to tell you, man. We need that nigga. <laughs> Did y'all see Terrence Howard on Joe Rogan? Let me tell you something. I watched, I forgot what playoff game I was watching. I literally came to the game late. Like, I turned on the game late because I was so stuck <laughs> in the rabbit hole. It just pulled you. You ever, a you ever have a conversation with somebody, right? With a man. <laughs> you, you ever ask a question to a man? <laughs> And then when you ask the question to the man, like, instead of just answering directly to that question, he takes you down 40 other rabbit holes. <laughs> yes, yes. Kanye. And, and still, that's exactly how yes. I felt when I was watching Terrence. But it was like. You're like, wait, what the fuck are we talking about? Yeah, <laughs> part of me was like, wait, maybe I'm just fucking dumb. <laughs> maybe he right. No, because again, he had a lot of theories on that podcast. And shout out to the Joe Rogan podcast. You know, that is where. I would I, I would say people that like to use their mind go. People okay. that are thinkers. That you're gonna talk. You're, yeah, gonna, you're talk. gonna talk. You're gonna yeah. get into some very in-depth, inept conversations, right? Mm -hmm. That's what they do on the Joe Rogan podcast, yeah. right? So I was kind of expecting that already, but <laughs> this nigga confused Joe Rogan. <laughs> I've never, I seen, never that. seen that. Oh my God, I love when like you realize, okay, it is a little confusing, <laughs> but then you really lock in. You're like, okay, I'm gonna under <laughs> I'm gonna fucking understand Stanley's what he's fucking, fucking talking about. He's trying to say. And it doesn't work. That's it's how I feel about work. Gunna's lyrics. <laughs> I literally try so hard to be like, what the fuck is he saying? <laughs> and then I really try to concentrate, and then he'd be like, and that's why I don't know it. And, like, and I like I have no idea what's going on. <laughs> and then I just you. surrender. I just surrender. Marvel that's how they did They should have cast this nigga in Iron Man. They need this nigga. Or Doctor Strange. <laughs> Doctor Strange. Strange. Now wasn't he wasn't he on a uh, Marvel movie? They got rid of him, he right? For Don Cheadle. For my man. Your man. Don. 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 You see what happened, Don. man? Don the goat. Like, yeah. like, I'm telling you, bro. Like <laughs> this nigga decided. Nah. I don't know. I promise you. In, nah. in a few years, and like, so I tried to <laughs> listen to it. it I listened to about halfway through, right? <laughs> I, I the way your brain was like, wait, what? I was listening. I'm trying to pick up the jewels. I'm like, yo, this nigga Trying. really might be Iron Man. Man. Like, I didn't know where he was taking us. I know he had a ton of patents. I know he was like pulling yeah. up some websites. He was like, yo, yeah. you got to check out IUDCEU college and shit. Like, he was pulling up mad references. I'm like, oh yo. shit, this nigga, he's either the most, the, the most intelligent, yeah. smartest man to ever walk the earth, right. or, we just or, dumbest. <laughs> He needs help. <laughs> well, like the most and ridiculous. Needs, I'm like, trying to tell you. See, what made me think that I was a little fucking stupid and pacified. <laughs> I'm sorry, Kendrick. <laughs> y'all yeah, missed it. I, nah, I got you. <laughs> I got you. I got you. Well, good. Music that was good. I, didn't, I didn't think it was funny. Like, <laughs> oh, I, really, I just didn't really. I Damn. Was, oh, I he, said, he said, no, Alex, I heard you. It just wasn't funny. <laughs> he, he, said, he, said it, he said it was whack. <laughs> Alex, he really, he really oh, said oh, it and he was like, no one's laughing. He's like, oh, you guys didn't hear me. Yeah. <laughs> I'm so stupid. Oh, oh, wait. I'm sorry. That was a good joke. All right, but now for real, for real this time. <laughs> what made me feel like I was stupid in the moment is because Terrence started to highlight the founders of some of these concepts and theories. Tesla. Oh. Right. And the uh, I forgot Nick the dude's name. The dude that started the periodic table. Oh, Demetrius Mandeleev. That don't sound like that nigga name, but look nah, it up. Yeah, yeah. He started... Just he, check, double check. Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. I think you're in front of you. Nah, right, right, but I was maybe, you know, right, you could be right. I don't know. Remember, I'm confused still. <laughs> <laughs> when he started to break down their concepts, like he was, he basically came in an episode trying to debunk a lot of the theories that we've heralded in school, that we've heralded over the years, that we've just known for fact. And then when Joe Rogan, smart ass, ain't know what to say, that's when I said, oh shit, I've been dumb. <laughs> I've been dumb. <laughs> I, it, which I, I don't know. It was Demetrius Manley. Thank by you. The way. I'm sorry. See? You know, you, you know, know, I'm the science buff here. You are. Come my on, fault. I just had to make sure because them niggas was naming mad names. Yeah, yeah. My well, fault. It was. Nah, no but yeah, Joe, Joe, Joe was stuck. Galileo. Was stuck. Them niggas was naming shit. 
<laughs> so I admit I did not watch it in full, but yeah. I don't know if this tweet was a joke or if like he really said this. Did he say that he remembers being in the womb? Yeah, that's how he opened the pod. <laughs> that was that was in oh like the God. first hour and a half. Wait. That's how he opened the pod. He that's said, a real thing. So what did how <laughs> he said? I knew I was different. Right now, <laughs> wait. We get on this podcast like I like to think I'm different too. I always talk about yo, I got mad high work ethic and shit. I got a landing strip on the back of my head. Like I know I'm different too. I got mad. Different <laughs> Qualities. He looked at Joe Rogan in his face and he said, you know what, man? When I was in the pussy, man, I remember seeing the light, man. My mama used to put the light on, on the stomach, man. He did. Nah, he, he said he didn't know he was in the fucking stomach. He just heard voices. It was his mother voice or some shit. And when I saw my hand, man, the hand, I ain't know it was a hand, the man, hand, man. But I knew it was something. <laughs> so I remember being in my mom. Put, now, I don't know if he remembers coming out the joint. I don't know, but. He said he has oh. a deep Wasn't recollection. Wasn't he like now, dead serious? He was very yes. serious. Straight face. This entire, like, Straight face. He's an amazing actor. And, and <laughs> yeah, because that's reasons, why I don't trust him. He's an actor. Like, he's reasons, also very educated, though. I didn't know that. Yeah. He, he is. Yeah, I, didn't know, I that. didn't know that. A lot I of really the things didn't. that he said, and I didn't look it up in real time, but I also, again, one of the reasons why I think the Joe Rogan podcast is like the biggest podcast in the world. It's not only because of Joe Rogan, but it's also because of one of his producers, Jamie. Got you. Jamie is somebody who does research in real time. Jamie mm -hmm. is actually one of the people who inspired us to kind of take that model and implement it into Joe's podcast right. when you were acting as screaming, screaming right? Shit, yep. Like, yep, yep. That's Jamie's role on that podcast very important. is very and important Alex because well. yeah, yeah. he Thank brings you. up real time <laughs> information for the guests yeah. for Joe yeah. Rogan, the host. especially with those topics. Yeah. And he's <laughs> extremely, extremely, and shout out to Jamie and all the producers in podcast land. Mm -hmm. But he's extremely accurate with the information that he pulls up for Joe Rogan. Mm -hmm. So as Terrence Howard is speaking to Joe Rogan, he's asking Jamie, "Hey, can you pull this up? I got proof on some of the patents that I made that." Tesla and Sony and Microsoft and some of these larger companies have yeah. worked off of, they were my ideas back in the 90s when I patented, but I'm not getting money for it. So it's a very mm -hmm. interesting yeah. concept, right. a very interesting interview. I didn't look up, I didn't personally fact check him. Mm -hmm. um, but again, I, I guess it goes back to like the TMZ rule. Like there's certain outlets that we believe to find facts and truth. And Jamie mm -hmm. on that podcast is hey. one of the people who I take like I'm, I'm know, rocking, do the job. I'm, I'm rocking with my black man because I ain't seen none of you scientists come out. Y'all scared, huh? And, and y'all want to come to, wrestle with my man Terrence outside? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I ain't, usually you know people come real quick, start debunking shit. Oh, actually, in the Protagonist theorem, mm -hmm. like I ain't seen nobody come out yet. Yeah. So I don't know if he got the scientist shook. But that's the thing. That's my man. When T. we hear about Kanye West, that's my man. Right, Kanye West, yeah. a lot of people deem him to be crazy. So now I can't even look at somebody like a Terrence Howard and say he's a crazy man because <laughs> he really might be spitting facts. Like yeah. I, I don't I don't know. I, I'm not yeah. a scientist. I'm yeah. science is not my thing. Like I, I I enjoy the discourse and one of the things that I really love about the Joe Rogan podcast yeah. is it challenges thought. Absolutely. It challenges yeah. your thinking. Absolutely. Despite what you believe in, what you don't believe in. There's some guests that come on, there's some mm -hmm. conversations that they are willing to have mm -hmm. at such a large platform that is just going to make you second guess certain things yeah. and think a certain way. Different yeah. perspectives. And yeah. not for nothing, like one topic, and I want to go to a music show, I know that's who we're going to go to next, but one topic that stuck with me from that episode that made me think was the periodic table conversation. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And Terrence's theory around that was basically like, he said he would tell his professor sometimes like, hey man, you don't see like how... There are certain colors that are the same colors, but different elements. Like, you don't think there's anything to that? He used to say the professor would be like, nah, man, it's nothing. They're all different. And then in his research, he learned that a lot of those elements perform the same duties. For sure. Yeah. <gasps> So he yeah. was like, how did you guys not pay attention to, uh, this is what I did like though. He he pays a lot of attention to vibration. Oh my God. And, and frequency and sound. Bro, I was. Yeah, that fucked me up. That's what had me like, I'm stupid. 